What is going on guys? We are here at the Chuck E. Cheese in Fairfield, California. I believe they just recently like reopened uh, and I believe it's a 2.0. And over there you can see the uh, Chuck E. Cheese sign right there. And we are going to go inside and we're gonna see what they got. All right, so we are inside and here is the uh, dance floor and all the uh, you know, heads move around just like all the other dance floors. It, uh, has like you know some uh, bars on my camera not sure what it is but over here is the where a kid can be a uh, kid with the uh, eye missing so I guess you got to stand there and then here is the uh, kick blaster so you get this for being a birthday star or like a summer fun um, I think it's like gold and silver um, not sure about bronze then here is the uh, party sign There's party and then See, over here are some uh, more uh, signs and silhouettes. Here is the uh, Chuckies, so there's five of them. And then here is uh, the Squally, or my bad, Chef the Squally. There's a little blur about him. And then there is uh, Mr. Munch and his little bio. And then here is uh, Helen Henny with her bio. And then there is a TV, and there is a uh, you know, like a bigger TV. And then uh, over here is uh, Chucky to go, you know, check him out. So here is Chucky Cheese and, you know, his little bio. And then here is Jasper T. Jowls and his bio. So that's pretty cool. All the, uh, you know, silhouettes are on one wall. Some of them have like, uh, you know, silhouettes on like one wall and then another wall, not like a third wall, but here, um, they're all on one wall, which is, not, which is really nice. And then there's uh, you know, Chucky, and then here's some, uh, you know, eating. Yeah, so there's the uh, dining area. There's actually a few people there now. Don't want to get them in. So yeah, here's uh, some more seating. And there's actually a lot of, like, you know, uh, seating over there as well. And then uh, there's uh, the pickup sign, and the third station, and the beverages. And here are the rides and games. So this is the uh, Chucky's uh, photo ride. Pretty cool. Then here is the... Uh, Racing, it's like a cartoon. I'm not sure um, what that is exactly. Here is Pirates Hook and the Jackpot's Pipe. That's pretty good. And then here is um, the Minions Whack a Mole game. And then here is the Wheels on the Bus. And here's a couple more boots and the All You Can Play sign. And another look at the uh, dining area. So pretty nice, actually. It's very clean here. Very clean. So here is the uh, high five. It's like a mini speed of light. Here is a car ride. Let's see. Let's get a better look at that one. That's pretty cool. I'm not sure what the exact name is. I think the there is the uh, Casey Cobra. And there's some more boots and the high five sign. And here is a uh, carousel. It says where a kid can be a kid. Um, it does not have the uh, uh, part where you can sit on it. Uh, let's see. Um, here are some more boots. And then here's the Barney ride. It's pretty cool, somewhat rare, I think. And then here is the uh, Shopkins ride. It's like a watermelon, I think. And then here is uh, Dead Storm Pirates, which is at pretty much every Chuck E. Cheese. And then here is the, um, called the air hockey table. And then here is the helmet ride. Here is uh, Goal Line Rush. And the Jackpot is 50, and it does have a gold football. Some places do not have a gold football, which is very unfortunate. Here is Zombie Land Battle. Pretty rare. And here is Little Hoops. That's pretty cool. It's a uh, pretty rare, I think. I don't think uh, I've seen a Little Hoop. I've seen like you know NBA Hoop Troop, but this is a Little Hoop, which is basically the same idea, but it's uh, not the exact same. But that's really cool. Here is Bigfoot Crush, and then more uh, places to sit and eat. And here is like a gaming mural. And uh, let's see, um, I got that. Here is the SpongeBob SquarePants Jelly Fishing. That's pretty cool, pretty rare. And let's see, here is Trolls. Let's see, um, let's see the jackpot's what? 50, 30, and I'm not sure that is. I'm not sure, 20, so I think 50 is the highest. Here is the uh, Fun House, it's like a photo booth. And then here is a Hop and Stack for 100, That's pretty rare. And then here is uh, Pink Panther for 150. That's really good. It's funny, it says 100, but it's actually 150. And then uh, here is a uh, tightrope 
pretty hard, but pretty good. Then here's a uh, Paw Patrol for 50. And then here is Grand Piano Keys. And then here is uh, Fruit Ninja, which is pretty common. It's a pretty good game. And then here is the uh, Monster Drop. And here is Quick Drop for 73. And it's two credits, which is a bit odd. Most of them are one for a uh, Quick Drop. And there is a uh, Wacko and Super Frenzy. And there's actually a quarter right here, so that's pretty cool. Uh, <laughs> here is uh, Iceman. And then here is Robot Storm. That's very, very rare. I've never seen that before. Or if I have, I haven't seen it in a long time. Might be at San Jose. Let's see. Uh, there is the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And then uh, there is uh, Space Invaders for 100. That's really cool. Um, here is the Jurassic Park Arcade. Uh, let's see. Here is the Two Minute Drill. And there are a lot of balls. And the jackpot is uh, 10. You don't need to be 450. And this is really cool. It is the green ski ball. You do not see this very often. Like, um, this is the better ski ball. You can actually get in the 10,000 um, somewhat consistently. That was bad, but um, I have gotten a uh, jackpot on this one before. But yeah, that's really cool. Um, 40,000 is actually pretty, actually very doable. So um, that's a very good ski ball. Um, alley roller is much harder than this one. Here is uh, NBA game time for 100. And, um, there's actually a credit on there, but yeah, that's a good, uh, good jackpot. And here is uh, um, goldfishing, pretty rare. Um, I'm not sure what the uh, score to beat is, but it's for 100 tickets. And this is uh, pretty rare for a Chuck Cheese in general. And here's also another rare game for Chuck Cheese. It's the uh, called Full Tilt, and the jackpot's 50. And here is the uh, SpongeBob SquarePants Pineapple Coin Pusher. And there are a lot of cards there, and um, a lot of cards there as well. And you actually get like a bonus for uh, putting in extra credits. And the jackpot is 250. That's very good um, for a Chuck E. Cheese. Um, there is where a kid can be a kid. And there's uh, some like, you know, lights or lamps, whatever they're called. Uh, here is Harpoon Lagoon. And then uh, here is what's called uh, Dizzy Chicken. And the jackpot is 100. That's good. And then here is uh, Maze Escape, a uh, pretty hard game uh, for 50. And then let's see, here is uh, Slam Winner for 100. And then here is Red Hot for 100. And let's see, uh, here is a uh, Prison Blast times 2. And here is a uh, Spinner Frenzy. And a jackpot is what? 100. And then uh, let's see, here is Crossroads. And there's no jackpot, but it just has tickets next to it. Um, it might be like the one in uh, Placentia where you just get, um, you know, a uh, you know, random or not like random, but like you just get like a max amount of tickets, like after a while, like you get like 10. Um, there's no jackpot, which is uh, somewhat unfortunate. But uh, here is the um, uh, Chuck Eats Fun Photos. Uh, more uh, look at the uh, dining area. And here is the uh, kiosk, another kiosk. And then, ooh, here is Space Warp 66. This is a great game, uh, really fun. And the jackpot is uh, 50. And then uh, here is uh, Halo Fire Team Raven. That's a really really uh you know cool find and here is um hoop it up and let's see uh one hoop uh wins uh, 25 and you get in there you win a ball which is really cool um so you actually like win an actual item here is um jelly lab for 250 which is pretty cool and they have the jellies and here is dicey jump and instead the jackpot is 200 which is really good i'm not sure like what it resets to because i know the one like chino it'll go up to 100 and then it'll reset by 50 Oh, it's been broken there for a while. Here is top block, and the jackpot is 50, which is pretty standard. And here is uh, Nerf, and the jackpot is 500, which is really good. Um, unfortunately, I don't have time to play. Here is the bouncy ball uh, claw machine. And I think that's everything um, as far as the games are concerned. Um, but yeah, there's a, there's a lot of good games here, and there's some pretty good jackpots. Uh, there's more of a seating area. Um, there is the Happy Turkey Day and Welcome to Turkey Keys restrooms and the uh, Chill Out and the Dippin' Dots and the uh, Cotton Candy and there are the prizes. Um, pretty, pretty standard, I guess. And there are the items to buy and some uh, prizes that are and bigger prizes. And here's the, uh, the, the, the advertisement for the Summer Fun Pass. Pretty cool. Um, not sure if I'm gonna get it, but it is definitely better than one last year. But the one two years ago was like really, really good. But yeah, this is a Chuck E. Cheese in uh, Fairfield, California. Overall, it's a pretty good Chuck E. Cheese, and I almost missed uh, this, but there are the uh, TVs up there. 
And um, yeah, I think that's everything. If I miss anything, I do apologize. Um, but yeah, this is a pretty good location. I hope you enjoy watching it. If there's anything I missed, uh, please let me know. Um, I do apologize, but I do appreciate everyone watching um, this tour of Chuck E. Cheese in Fairfield, California with their 2.0 remodel. I don't know what they have before. So if anyone can tell me what they have before, please let me know. Thank you so much for watching. I've enjoyed and see you again next time.